Thanks. Hello, viewers. In this edition, I have the singular honor of introducing to you one of Ghana's actresses, TV presenter, voiceover artist, CEO of uh, Glow City, and a great actress in most Ghanaian film. She won the Best Supporting Actress Award in the 2020 Africa Music Viewers' Choice Awards for their role in Shelly Frimpong Manzo's Perfect Picture 10 years later. Please, let's welcome this Sorry. great woman of substance who has just landed the role as African Sustainability Ambassador towards the upcoming African Sustainability Concert in the UK in October 2024. Madam Gloria Ama Safu. You're welcome, Madam. <laughs> thank you so much, sir, for having me. How are you doing? Me. You look gorgeous. I'm very well, thank you. So, congratulations, <laughs> Gloria, on your appointment as African Sustainability Ambassador. That is that is an Thank amazing you. thing. Yes, it is. And we can't wait to see you work to perfection. Absolutely. Right? I, I will What does this I new role <laughs> mean to you, both personally and professionally? Well, first of all, I, I must say thank you. Thank you very much for, mm. uh, yes, appreciating right. <laughs> my role You're welcome. You're as, welcome. as um, a brand ambassador for mm. Africa Sustainability um, Concert. Concert. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's such an honor, and I must say that um, being appointed for sustainability is, is a huge honor, mm. and, and that's where I will say a big thank you to the PE group mm. for this uh, global recognition. Right. I, I don't take it for granted at all. I truly appreciate it. Thank yes, you. Thank you. I, I'm, su I'm super excited. Ah. <laughs> yes, yeah, so thank you very Man, we, much. We made the right choice as well. Oh, mm. wow. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the compliment. Yes. Wow. Well, let's go straight to personally. I'm a very passionate person. You know, I'm, I'm very passionate about um, Africa's environment and mm. its incredible potential for a sustainable future. Mm. And, you know, this role will actually help me to be able to use my platform to um, make a real difference uh, on, on a large scale. Mm. And I'm determined, however, to champion initiatives that will benefit um, the entire Africa. And, you know, professionally, this is actually an amazing opportunity for me to collaborate with other talented um, people across Africa. You know, by so doing, we'll be able to, you know, uh, share best practices mm. uh, and uh, <coughs> develop innovative um, um, so solutions or initiative, um, you know, and most importantly, have a united voice, mm. you know, um, for a sustainable future. Right. Great. Lisa up International. Mm. That is your <laughs> baby, isn't it? Yes, it Good. is. <laughs> Can you tell us more about Lisa up International and some of its key initiatives? Please? Right. Thank you for that question. Mm. Wow. Well, Mm -hmm. That's actually a dream come true, you know. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so um, Lace Up International is actually a, a registered Ghanaian advertising company mm. that specializes in um, TV and radio commercials, mm. um, voiceover recording, artist management and promotion, event organization mm. and outsourcing and a whole lot. Mm. Yes. And yes. A whole lot for Lace Up. And uh, one thing about Lace Up too is that um, we we are very passionate about giving back to society mm -hmm. and hence the um, Gloria Safo Foundation mm -hmm. where we actually donate to the less privileged quarterly. Wonderful. Oh, that's yes, it. as as Great. a CSR. Great. Yes, absolutely. Great. <laughs> Um, in the society. So basically these are some of the things that Lace Up stand for. And do you do you do have a sector uh, which um educates people on how to do this advertising voiceover and do you have a sector like that where you yes, educate? Yes, we, we are planning on, on seminars and forums, you know, mm. um, and platforms to help educate um, people yeah, and because to, there are, to mentor. There are, there, there are people out there who, who take you as a mentor and yes, they want to follow yeah. in your footsteps and they might like to be educated in that line. So if you have an institute like that with Blaze Up, yeah, well, we're, we're, we're planning on something like that. Yeah. It's, in, it's in the pipeline, actually. Wonderful, so wonderful. Lisa has been able to work 
with um, big companies such as um, MTN, Ghana, Vodafone Ghana for Vodafone Health Line. Right. Uh, yes, which I hosted uh, this season. It was amazing. Yeah, and um, also um, Game Park Ghana, mm. TCL, Danu Milk, mm. a, a host of others. I mean, uh, Darling Hair, a number of um, you know companies. Yes, and yes. So basically, don't forget that Lisa is also. And you work with um, the celebrities, artists. <laughs> yes. Oh yes, definitely. <laughs> Definitely. So we do artist uh, artist promotion and all mm, that. Yeah, so that's right. Um, that's right. there are a lot of things that mm. we, we do as well. And you know, um, other organizing agencies or organize, um, event organizers also mm. outsource, you know, the services of Lisa. Lisa. You know, okay. Um, specifically getting artists for their event mm. and all that. Mm. And mm. oh, we are also a career service company so we do a lot a Jack lot, of all a lot, a lot. <laughs> good so how do you plan to leverage your platform and influence as an actress mm. to raise awareness and sustainability issues well that's a good question mm. well as an actress i will be more careful to choose film projects and roles that you know, highlight environmental issues. I wouldn't be surprised that you already have a film in mind. <laughs> How did you know hmm? that? <laughs> You're so excited. Pipeline. I know. I can just read. It's in the pipeline. We'll share later. Mm, we'll, share, we'll share that wonderful. later. Then yep. it's later, yeah. Good. So um, basically, yes, um, you know, um, I'll, I'll also be able to use my social media platforms mm. to mm. Um, share informative and inspiring content you know, um, that really talks about um, sustainability or a sustainable future mm. Thank you. in Africa. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Yeah. Look, so what do you make of the African sustainable concept, the upcoming sustainable concept, mm. and what impact do you hope it will have on the continent of Africa? Oh, wow. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait I know, for October I know, to come. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Well, African Sustainable Concert. Oh, my goodness. Um, I'm going to be there myself. Oh, yes, yes, of course. We're going to have fun. <laughs> that makes it two of us. Yeah. We're definitely going to have fun. Right. And I'm, I'm super excited about mm. um, the impact it's going to make, uh, right. make right. on the entire continent. Right. Yeah, so it's, it's such an amazing um, mm. initiative. And kudos to the PE group. You know, thank you. Thank <laughs> for you. This brilliant thank initiative. You. Thank you. And you, you know, the concert has the potential mm. of um, making a great impact mm. um, on on a global stage. Right. You know? Yeah. Sure. Oh, yeah. and already a lot of African countries are registering to come to the oh, event. Yes, oh yes, I'm yes. super excited about mm. that. A lot of I heard about that and I was like, mm. oh my goodness. So we were actually Africa was actually waiting for an ish initiative like this. Wonderful. And yeah. I, really I mean, it makes me mm. so happy. You know, to hear that. You know, uh, one thing about Africa is our music, our That's music, it. our culture. Mm -hmm. You know, music on its own has um, uh, the potential uh, of you know, it, it has a unique, <laughs> unique Pretty way sure. of bringing, bringing people, people together, together. Right. and inspire. Mm. And and that's why this concert is going to be a great platform. Um, to that is showcase, why it's so important. To absolutely, you. to showcase. Um, um, innovative solutions no, and of course especially um, the successes of sustainability projects that are happening in Africa. Wonderful, yes. wonderful. <laughs> so how would you balance your act acting career with your commitments to sustainability and corporate social responsibility? How are you going to marry the two? Well it's possible. I know. <laughs> it's always possible. Know. You're great. <laughs> <laughs> Well, combining my acting career mm -hmm. or acting, you know, um, with um, the power of this um, ambassador role, role. Mm. Uh, for sustainability, a more effective, um, you know, planning mm. and, um, and flexibility. And for other um, ambassadorial tasks, you mm. know, I sometimes I can just do it alone. Mm. I need mm. that support. Right, you need support. Systems, yeah. you know, so I can, I can, yeah, I can equally delegate or collaborate with other sustainability advocates, mm -hmm. you know, um, in Africa. Mm. Um, and it will allow me to 
still be involved mm -hmm. uh, while I ensure that the other voices are heard too. Mm -hmm. And of course, definitely, I'll use my social media platforms, mm -hmm. you know, um, and red carpet interviews and Wonderful. social media posts and Wonderful. all that to, to, to raise awareness Wonderful. about specific um, sustainability challenges. Great. Gloria. Yes, sir. How important is it okay for me to call you Gloria? Why, why oh, not? <laughs> it's a it pleasure. How, how, how important is it to engage the next generation of leaders in sustainability efforts and what strategies can be employed to achieve this? Wow. Um, well, engaging the next um, generation of leaders mm. in sustainability is absolutely crucial. Mm. But, well, here are some of my... Um, strategies right. you know outlined right. Right. first um i would try my possible best to speak to the policy <clears throat> makers mm. you know to integrate sustainability um education in the school um curriculums that's a good idea at all levels mm. yes that's and a good idea. you know it's a way of catching them young <laughs> you know you can for sustainability can purposes absolutely yeah and also, um, I will support the youth-led organizations mm. and initiatives mm. um, focused on sustainability. Mm. And of course, um, try my best to, to organize some social media campaigns mm. to encourage the young ones mm. to um, you know, share their ideas right. when necessary. Right. Right. And also to collaborate mm. um, on sustainable um, solutions or, or you know, initiatives. Right. Yeah. That's fine. That's mm. good. So as an actress, you've portrayed many characters and stories. How do you see storytelling playing a role in promoting sustainability and environmental issues? Wow. Mm -hmm. As an actress. Uh, yes, of course. Mm -hmm. that, that, we, 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 we delved uh, right into my industry, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, so... Um, one thing I know about um, storytelling as a filmmaker is, is one of the, the, the greatest tool, I mean, for any filmmaker or for any film projects. Right. Because um, storytelling, it's very crucial. It's, mm. it's what actually informs mm. or sends messages across, right. you know, um, as far as the project is concerned. And, you know, with storytelling, uh, the beautiful part of it is its versatility, mm -hmm. how it's able to spread wings mm -hmm. for to share for everyone to right. you know partake and journey along with with the projects, yeah, right. or the message mm -hmm. being carried. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's not only about entertainment. Right. I mean, storytelling right. is not only right. about entertainment. Um, it's how you connect with the people and yeah. especially on, a, on an emotional level mm. and and which i think that um if, if we are able to you know um, um create stories uh, write stories tell stories around um like you know, stories like, you and know the Anansi yes. stories mm. and all the folklore mm. and all that gone are the days where we we used to hear those stories a lot but mm. it looks like it's 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 dying off we don't know right. what's happening to our industry but hey um one sustainability is is now a topic you know to 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 um to look at so i'm very Did sure that things rolling we're we yes. going to i mm. mean get things rolling in that direction mm. and yes that's fine um, that's fine it's going to make impact Good. Good. yeah absolutely so yeah, storytelling plays a, a big a big role. Wonderful. And, yeah. So what has been your most memorable role as an actress? Mm -hmm. And how has it influenced your corporate social responsibility? Wow, CSR. <laughs> okay, so um, uh, personally, I have a number of them. Mm. But there is this very role that um, I think I really personally... Um, was proud of myself mm. of the fact that I was able to help, uh, you know, um, advocate mm. um, um, about a certain pandemic that happened mm. to the world, mm. talking about the COVID-19. The COVID-19, yeah. yeah. So okay. um, during that time, somewhere 2020, I was able to, I, I was fortunate actually to, to be contacted for a project mm. in that direction, mm. a project that, you know, was um, prepared or designed to actually help curb um, um, COVID-19 and also help the advocacy 
uh, of uh, the safety protocols against COVID-19 at the time. And that was um, Corona Life Series. I did, I did uh, about two projects during that time, Corona Life Series and also... Um, were they very successful? They were absolutely successful. One Wonderful. was with Kwame Bwedi, mm. um, who mm. collaborated mm. with um, the Ministry of uh, Water and Housing. Right. And Bank of Ghana, and I think the Ministry of Health or so, yeah. Um, that was the Corona Life. Right. It was one of um, the projects that I think um, really um, helped me to... Yes actually exercise my social right, responsibility right, right. yeah and it was a two two cast movie wow. um, series actually mm. uh, i don't know if you remember this <laughs> there was a time in ghana during that time was it during 2020 i think the COVID somewhere 19 period. COVID 19 mm. period mm. where um it was all over the news right. that um uh, mickey was saying that Kong and i were getting married See that again. getting intimacy yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was intimate, all over the sorry. place yeah and all that was mm. all of the news. Mm. So mm. that was what we were working on. Okay. It was that project, okay. you know. And looking back, I, I think um, it, it is always good to do a thing like that because of the impact it was able to have on the society, people, right. you know, positively though. I mean, people mm. thought we were getting married and all that, but eventually they ended up, you know, watching the, the, the project. The project. And it, it, it went a long way too. To you know, educate, educate people them against on the, absolutely yes, protocols yeah, so. and all that. <laughs> we played right. a couple, and mm. it was it was such was an nice. amazing experience. Nice. Nice. Yeah, mm. so Corona Live series and mm. um, as in between by Shelley Pim for Manso. Yeah, good. So, my last question for you. Oh, last. Oh, <laughs> all too soon. <laughs> no. No, what message would you like to send to potential partners and attendees of the African Sustainable Concert? come October 2024 in London. Who? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah. so um, I, I, I'm very sure that you've seen the excitement mm. around uh -huh. me already. Uh -huh. yes. And yes, of course, I'm super excited mm. about this. And I'm thrilled, mm. however, to, to be a part of this, you know, um, incredible initiative. And uh, I, I believe that this concert will... Um, will not only be a celebration of music mm. you know mm. um, it's it's broad right it's it's, it's right. it will go a, a long way mm. to to um, raise awareness mm. about sustainability um issues that africa is facing at the moment yeah so um it, it, it's it's going to be good and i think p really... made a right choice absolutely to pick you as ambassador <laughs> oh. oh i'm flattered <laughs> <laughs> I'm flat oh, yes, so. to our potential partners. Your collaboration with the Africa Sustainable Concert will go a long way to make um, the concert a resounding success. By joining forces, we can turn the power of music into a powerful force for a positive change. Together, let's use the African Sustainable Concert as a springboard for action and let the music ignite a passion for a sustainable Africa. Together, let us turn that passion into a real progress. Thank you. Yeah, all too soon, we've come to the end of yet another edition. And I want to say a very big thank you to Gloria for making time to be with us. Thank, thank you, you madam. for having me, sir. See you in London, as I said. See you in London. Good. <laughs> and once again, I want to congratulate you for landing the role as ambassador for the sustainability concept come thank October 2024. You. Thank you, Thank sir. you so much. You. This has been your host, Eric Kingsley Ashi. Thank you.